All right, we got uh, Marc Andre Cliche here. Grew out a beautiful French mustache for Movember. One of the uh, last remaining guys to keep the mustache. How do you uh, how do you feel it went this year? Uh, I thought uh, there was a lot of highs and lows throughout the month of November. Uh, mostly highs, of course. <laughs> of course. Uh, yeah, uh, I learned a lot of things about myself and the mustache. Um, at the beginning, I'll be honest, I took it really uh, on the negative side. But uh, as the month went through, I think uh, I started like loving the mustache, actually. And uh, I think uh, today is going to be pretty emotional to um, shave it off. So you you will be upset when you shave it off? I think uh, it's going to be probably the worst part uh, of my day today. It's a long day, so a lot of parts to it. But it's going to be the worst part for sure. And, uh, I'm not going to lie, I might, I might keep it in a jar. And... Uh, just look at it sometimes. You're gonna keep it in the jar? Some people say that cucumber tastes better than pickle. What? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, uh, here we have Justin Azevedo supporting the uh, Portuguese mustache. It's a strong, uh, wide, thick brimmed mustache. Uh, how did uh, you feel your mustache turned out? Uh, I think it went pretty good. I mean, uh, this is, uh, it go the way it goes is uh, it grows like this in five days and it stays like that. It doesn't really, uh, doesn't change after five days. Um, I think the month of November was, uh, was a success. Um, we had a lot of guys on the team with, uh, with the Muzzy. Uh, Coach Morris, same thing. Um, this guy here, Muzz himself, had a terrible Muzz. Pretty embarrassing. Nothing. No Muzz. Try. But like I said, it was a, a pretty good success and uh, it was a lot of fun. As uh, as years go on, do you think you can see yourself growing a mustache and keeping it as an adult? Yeah. Now you're just a little boy. <laughs> Mark Andre Cleach would like me to know that you have a five o'clock shadow mustache. It's usually pretty. That's every day I have it. Pretty out there, so I mean, it's um, not really a new look for you, but it's just a bit thicker. I've actually been thinking about keeping it for the rest of my life right now. So, 22 years old. Got 30, 40, 40 more years ahead of me with At this least. Yeah. <laughs> All right, here we get Bud Holloway, number nine for the Manchester Monarchs. Uh, hi, Bud. Hey, Mark. Thanks for having me. Hi, hey, uh, Bud Vision. Hey, <laughs> hey, you're welcome, man. Uh, you, okay, you got me off guard here. But uh, how was uh, your month of November? How was your growth? Uh, growth was good. Strong. Uh, had to trim a couple of times. Was interfering with my food eating. Oh, let's, uh, let's see. Let's see the trim. Pretty good. Pretty good. So, but, uh, no, I had pretty good growth. Uh, I had to get a little Just For Men in there. I, oh, I mean, so. I don't want to give away my secret, but, uh, you know, it's uh, something people need to know. Well, I think it's a normal thing, you know. You, you want the mustache to be out there, I think it's good. Um, do you think you're uh, actually going to keep it for uh, the rest of your life? Uh, I don't know if it suits me real well, uh, especially when I have an afro. Uh, I may have let myself go a bit uh, this month of November, but... Uh, no, it was a good cause, and uh, I know me, you, as you know, the, all the boys that did it, Clooner, Hickey, there's a, you know, there's a pile of them, uh, did it for a good cause, mm -hmm. like, uh, yeah, Soupy JJ. and JJ, <laughs> DK for a bit until his girlfriend made him shave yeah. it off, Marty, I mean, pretty much all the boys grew it out, so. Uh, yeah. Probably, we're pro you're probably Arts, actually forgetting. Arts has a pretty good one, it kind of looks like yeah. a firefighter a bit. Uh, you're probably, you're, we're probably forgetting people. But uh, uh, I think I mean, it was for a good cause, and uh, would you like to say thanks for the support or something like that? I just, yeah, everyone that donated uh, towards the cause and stuff. I know it's uh, pretty big back home and everything, and you know, it's, it's something that uh, you will know, probably reappear next, uh, next Movember. So. All right, uh, now before we go, I want you to smile, same smile when, if you, as if you got your first Christmas gift. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> We'd like to thank everybody that participated this year in uh, November. Um, looking forward to seeing everybody next year again. Remember to get your prostate checked. One love. <laughs>